trying to offer the newest and the best of what's available for, for game players in the uh, United States. What's it like being an editor of a magazine like that? Well, it's a lot of fun. I mean, uh, it's, it's pretty glamorous as far as being able to play all the new game systems yeah. like you're going to see here today. Um, and we have people all around the country who write about the games, very knowledgeable people. Some of them create games, so they know the inside tips on, on the game systems. Mm -hmm. You know, when I was looking at the magazine, one of the things that really caught my eye were these maps that mapped out an entire video game. And, and I thought that would be great, you know, so I could play it better. But I also wondered, doesn't that kind of give away the game, or what is, what is it for? Some people say it gives away the game, but at the same time, the games are so complex. They're so difficult these days. To put a map in the game, which are very popular, the uh, people love to see the maps, it shows you different parts that you might get hung up on and uh, it, it becomes less discouraging. A game that you might have put on the shelf because it was too hard, you can get past a section that you were having trouble with before with the maps. Oh, you, so you can move up a level by using the map. Oh, that's, means, that's really yeah. neat. Well, Great. Andy, we have all this stuff here. Oh, let's start with this system right here. Tell okay. us a little bit about it. What this it is, is. the TurboGrafx-16 by NEC. Um, it has a lot of arcade quality games. Uh, very sharp graphics and sound, and the games come on small little uh, turbo chips, they call them. These are little game that. cards, a little bigger than like a credit card. Wow. And uh, they plug into the game system, and uh, what you get on the screen is phenomenal. Wow. What are some of the compo components of the system that you're going to get there? Well, with this system, it costs a little less than $200. You get the game machine, mm -hmm. you get a turbo pad, which is your controller, right. and uh, you get a game called Keith Courage in Alpha Zones, which is a, a, a running and jumping <laughs> game, oh, uh, very <laughs> similar to uh, Super Mario Brothers, but okay. again, the graphics, okay. uh, the character is very large, and, and uh, the sound is very spectacular. Wow. So any special features about this, I guess, besides the sound? Um, just that it's the next step. It's really right. the next game machine, uh, like the Genesis, in that it's a lot uh, crisper, mm -hmm. in, in, uh, the pictures are a lot crisper, mm -hmm. and the sound, instead of a lot of beeps and clicks that you used to get with the older game machines, right. you really hear music, and you really hear voices. Wow. Mm -hmm. That looks great. Really? How much do these little guys cost? So you get a, two of them when you buy it. How uh, much the do cartridges those... will cost uh, uh, between $35 and $50. Okay. And uh, the hundreds of hours of, of play in, in each cartridge. In each cartridge, wow. You know what? I, I know there's no way we could have all these video games out here and not have somebody who would That's like to right. play this. Would anyone like to play somebody. this game here? Anybody want to play? How about you? Come right over here, ma'am. Nice round of applause over this young man. player. Hi. What's your name? Morgan, I'm going to start this for you. We'll just start right here. And you just play for a while, then we'll come back and ask what you think about it, okay? Okay. Okay. All right. Let's go on with it. Hey, look, why don't we check out this one? It's been singing at me since you walked <laughs> out here. What is the noise? And uh, what, what's this one called? Okay, this is the Sega Genesis. Uh, Sega is a familiar name. They already have their Sega Master System out. Again, this is their next generation video game machine. Uh, it's a 16-bit machine, which is a lot stronger uh, in computing power than the previous machines were. It, wow. too, will be just under $200. Wow. And the games come on cartridges similar to a Nintendo or the Sega Master System. Right. And uh, it allows you to play, again, arcade quality games in your home. Uh, right special here. components that you would get with this? With the Genesis, you get the Genesis Game Controller Pad. Right. And uh, Altered Beast, a familiar arcade game um, that has been translated to the Genesis in high quality. We, we played that one. That yeah. is, that's wild, isn't it? it is. uh, what, what I was wondering, what are, the, what are the features of this system? What, what kind of things will it do? Well, again, similar to the Turbo Graphics, it's a ne next generation machine in that the graphics are impeccable, almost like a painting, and, and just like what you'd see in the arcade in your home. Uh, and the sound, it contains a lot of digitized sounds where yeah. they, they take an actual voice and record it and turn it into a computer program so you hear actual voices on the screen telling you to uh, run this way or grab a power-up or you're safe at home base or something like that. Now, I was wondering, I, I, I read somewhere that you're able to hook this one up to somebody else's so you right. could get a couple of people, or how, how does that work? Right, there'll be a telegenesis modem. A okay. modem is a connection between two computers over a telephone, uh -huh. and you'll be able to play across town or across the country or across the world with another player. So like Greg and I player. could be in each at home, and then we could call each other on the phone and both play at the same time. By all means, you play baseball <laughs> from across town. Uh, that would be, well, that'd be wild. Now you told us before, but how much is it, the cost for this again? Just under $200, and mm -hmm. again, the cartridges will be similarly priced, about $30, $40. Okay. Yeah. Great. Now, are these cartridges compatible with the 8-bit system, isn't that the, that was the pre, prelude to this Unfortunately not, one. because these are the next generation game machines. Okay. There will be an adapter called the Power Base Converter, okay. which you can plug into your Genesis, which will allow you to play Sega Master System games on your Genesis. Again, there won't be any improvement in quality, but all those games that you've got saved up in the library, you can use them on the Genesis. You can wow. use them on this, but you can't take the cartridges that are built for this and put them on the old Unfortunately one. Unfortunately not. It? It's a okay. different machine. Oh, I okay. see. All right. Great. Should uh, we get somebody to try this one out, Greg? I don't know. Anybody want to play this one over here? 
somebody? Just a few hands up there. How about this guy right here in the front? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Come up here, buddy. Yeah. Let me get your turn around right here. What is your name? Michael. Michael, will you try and mind to play this for us and then give us kind of your review at the end? Okay. All right. Here we go. You get. Can you get started and everything right there? Okay. He's got that going. Now, this is the one I love. Yeah. <laughs> This, this little guy, what is this? That's Tell the Nintendo that. Game Boy. And the name Nintendo is no, you know, it's not, it's, it's familiar to everybody who plays right. video games because they're very popular yeah. now. Yeah. But this is their portable game system. It's called the Game Boy. Right. And uh, uh, it's, unlike older handheld games, they aren't limited to one single game. Yeah. Again, like a Nintendo uh, home system, they have cartridges that you can plug into the Game Boy right. that let you play different games. Uh, Super Mario Land, break, uh, Alleyway is a breakout kind of game, brick breaking, uh, baseball, tennis, and Tetris. Now, I do remember some, some little things like this we used to have back in school. I think you played football or soccer. Right. right. What's the difference between this and those? The cartridges are the key because you can change games. The older games were limited to the football game. Right. You'd buy it, you were stuck playing the football. If right. you wanted to play you golf, you had to buy another machine. So, so this one, you can play all those games, all the all the games that are available right. by, by using the same... Now, this right. thing is really light. This, this is the yeah. whole bit. There, that's there's, the whole that's thing. it. That's, that's all you need. That's the whole need. thing. It's, uh, it's going right. to be about $90. The mm -hmm. cartridges will be about $25. Okay. And it'll be a lot of the familiar games that you've seen on the Nintendo Entertainment System. There'll be Castlevania-like uh, games. And, uh, of course, the Mario Brothers Super Mario Land will yeah. be available. Um, and it has a stereo headphone jack so that you can listen in stereo. Okay, That's great. great. And, and, and then I see we've got two of them here. Now, what right. are we going to do with that? Well, Nintendo has come up with a way for two players to play the Game Boy together. Yeah. You have a video link cable that plugs into the side here. All right. And this one would plug into yours. I see. Cool. cool. <laughs> I can oh, do this, I'm sure. <laughs> See, mechanical. There, I've got it. I've done it myself. Yeah. Okay. And when we're hooked up together, right. uh, we can play baseball where I'm pitching the ball, you're batting, or Tetris oh, where we're playing uh, on our own, our own uh, games. You see yours, I see mine, but they interact. Right. Uh, when I get something, you So you if Greg lose. and I can get a really long cord, we can play this one across town right, okay? That's true. <laughs> okay, we're almost, we got, we got to hurry here, but I got to see this one. Okay. That's Greg's favorite. What's He's the name of this? What is well, this? this is the Atari Lynx, mm -hmm. and it's uh, similar to the Game Boy in that it's portable. Mm -hmm. It's a little bit larger, so you can't put it in your pocket, but it, right. it fits into a book bag. Um, it's going to be about $140, and its main difference, again, it, it has cartridges, but it also is in color. In color. Wow. Yes. So the games are spectacular. California games, Gauntlet, uh, Rampage, games that arcade players are familiar with, they're going to be available on the links. And when will this one be available? Yeah. This will be available in October. Right. And uh, similar to the Game Boy, multiple players can get together and play together with a Comlinks cable. But the difference is uh, between 8 and 16 people can get together. Wow. On so you can one? get a party of people playing <laughs> Rampage. Wouldn't that be wild? That would yeah, be that's great. great. By all means. That's great. Great. Well, this looks fun. Listen, let's get over here and get our reviews. You wanna... Let's do reviews. Morgan's been here a little longer. You want to get her Morgan, first? Morgan, what do you think about this one over here? Turn right Maybe she here. can turn right around. What do you think about this one? It's different from other games. How is it different? Well, um... It, sometimes it works on Mac, there are different things, and some things su surprise you when you're playing. What did you, let me ask you, what did you think about the graphics? Did they look, did they look better than uh, other video games you've seen? Yeah. Yeah? Sounds. Okay, well that's a, that's a good rating for Mobile. Sounds here. like she really likes Let's it. When, when, will, when will the kids be able to get this particular game, do you know? Well, uh, by the time, uh, actually it should be shipping right now, so you, you can go to major toy stores and get that. Okay, now, what do you think? How do you like Sega Genesis? The remote slider and there's better graphics. So the remote slider and better graphics, do you recommend this? I mean, do you think this would be something you want to push for for the holiday season? Yeah. Definitely. Okay, Mom and Dad, you're hearing it right here, okay? <laughs> great. All right, thanks for playing it for us and giving us your review. Yeah. Andy Eddie, it's been great having thanks you. Thanks so much. Fantastic. Nice round of applause. Boy. Thank you. Mr. Andy thanks Eddie. Up. It's always nice to have an expert to help Absolutely. us out with something, isn't it? Coming up next is Banana Man. You guys stick around. Yeah. This is 29 Acacia Road, and this is Eric, the schoolboy who leads an exciting double life.